everyone. Welcome to Freebird Spirit YouTube channel. Thank you for swinging by and hanging out for a little bit as we do another deep dive. Uh, today we're focusing on SCOTUS. <clears throat> Just kind of adds a whole uh, in general for this. So um, let's go ahead and get started. <clears throat> okay. Okay, immediately what's coming in as I sit, as I stepped into the energy, and I don't know why. Seems so weird. All right. Sorry about that. Um, is uh, kind of like, um, uh, like a whirlwind uh, comes in, uh, air, and there's papers, and the papers are kind of flying everywhere, and they're trying to get them before anybody else sees them. Um so I feel like there's a, uh, a little bit of an upheaval and some information coming out. Now, um, I I don't feel like this affects everyone um, in school, you know, everybody that's sitting in the court, but there are a few people that are trying to, in particular, there's one person in particular um, that are trying to uh, keep these hidden and in place or whatever. So there's something going on with that. Okay, what else is coming in here? So it's like they're trying to get something, they're wanting something not to get out. Okay. Um, I'm hearing marching orders, so I'm wondering if uh, there will be, I mean, eventually, we don't have timing on this, there will be s several leaving. Okay, so I'm going to throw cards on this now to get more of the story here for us. And, um, but what I, uh, <clears throat> Oh, I'll pause it so you don't have to watch me shuffle and put it down. Hold on. Oh, I threw those cards. So, um, you know, I do sense that um, uh, Roberts has been trying to be creative or about holding things together. So he's the one out there grabbing on and trying to hold these papers. Um, <clears throat> I do feel that uh, some there's they're going to be held accountable. Total honesty. Uh, trying to put everything, and we're doing that anyways, as a globally, um, to the surface, so to speak, right? Um, and so nothing can be hidden, and that's this is happening in SCOTUS as well. Um, I do feel that um, <clears throat> as they review, they're they're going to be held accountable. Uh, there's going to be a review, and that's probably why they were showing me those papers going all over. Um, and they're going to be held accountable for uh, some of this giving and receiving situation. So let me show you what I'm looking at. This is, uh, you have the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. And um, there's the failure at keeping or, or holding accountable the giving and receiving. So that's going to be taken, taken, that's going to be looked at. So here's the cards again. So you all can see them. Wheel of Fortune, the Seven of Pentacles, and the Six of Pentacles. So that's kind of what they're going to be, look, they, they'll be looking at that. Um, they're also, they're failing the American people. And that's evident. Um, you have that star in reverse and four of wands, and that's that's the White House. That's 
to, in this reading to me, it, it's there's a failure here. Um, they're disappointing. How's that? Their disappointment to the White House, their disappointment to the American people. And um, so across that whole, what's happening here is um, a failure to serve the American people. And it's evident. And um, you have um, the Knight of Swords and the Hermit coming in um, to, to shine the light on the truth in regard to um, that giving and receiving of fundings. So there's going to be some swift actions taking place there on that. All right, what else do I see here? Yeah. Uh, so, okay. I'm going to throw again, so I'm going to pause here. And uh, let's throw, so ask another question and throw. Hold on. Okay. So I wanted more of the story and we got more of the story here, you guys. Um, I do see that, um, again, we have a, a, that there's the disappointment is, is obvious with this connection to the dark money and that business going on. Uh, it's deeper than what we we are seeing some of it and some of us know it's deeper, but it, this is talking that it's deeper than we know. And um, we are, that is coming to an end. It's gonna be like no longer, it's like almost a revamp of how the uh, SCOTUS is kind of put together and also how it runs and so forth. There's gonna be a big shift due to all the, under under stuff uh, if, if 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 this poison has gotten to that level um it needs to be cleaned out and and revamped and that's for sure and um so they are going to be confronted and have to retreat so uh, the The conservative, the conservative court, the people on the court that are conservative um, are going to be confronted and they will need to retreat um, because of their corruption. So these, so you can see it all in a row here for those of you who read the cards. They are going to have to retreat because of their corruption. You have bold leaders coming and, and making this reckoning and bringing clarity and making these decisions, but also bringing that whole revamping of the court. So, wow, all right. Well, I didn't know what I was stepping in, walking into when I decided when, well, I, I heard let's do SCOTUS. So I'm like, okay, let's do the whole SCOTUS. But we're going to see some real cleaning out of that system and uh, revamping it, revitalizing it so that uh, the American people can trust in their court again. Um, to have their back and to be making these big decisions for um, the benefit, uh, I mean, for our highest good, not for their pockets, right? All right, for entertainment purposes only. <laughs> I love you guys. Thanks for hanging out. And uh, thank you for your continued support and um, love. And um, yeah, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. And also, if you haven't, oh my goodness, go ahead and subscribe. It's for free.
Anyways, love you guys. See you next time.